Uh, hi, everybody. It's Joel. I just wanted to show uh, some things that I found uh, shopping this week. Uh, I left work early on Monday for an appointment, and uh, on my way, I was able to uh, stop at a few stores. And this is just some of the stuff that I found that's out now. All right, so number one is the 2016 Ford GT Race uh, Legends of Speed. And this is D case. Yeah, D case. All right, so this one's been out a while. I found Hot Wheels Speed Graphics, 70 Camaro, which the hot kiss uh, on the side, green. And this is the Speed Case. New for 2018, 71 Porsche 911, Nightburner Series, Urban Outlaw, Magnus Walker's car. And this is the uh, most recent case. This is uh, the E case that's out now. <clears throat> Thought this was cool. It's got the new design for the wheels, the Steelies. Like the color, and this is the tuned series Volkswagen Beetle. This is also an E case car. '69 Dodge Coronet Super B Hot Wheels Flame Series. This is an E case car. This one opened up, but just kept the truck in there for the time being. Mazda Repu. I like this color, red. It says Yokohama on the door. With uh, steely wheels, the new ones in a gold rim. Uh, hot truck series. And this was an E-case. really like this one. 10 Pro Stock Camaro with the Moon Eyes Speed Graphics. I picked up a couple of these. Okay, this was an E case. 69 Dodge Charger 500 Muscle Mania. This was an E case. A lot of good EK stuff. Recolor on the Chevelle SS wagon. I like the casting, but I'm not thrilled with the uh, with the yellow wheel up front. Um, the a yellow wheel is fine, but a yellow tire doesn't look uh, it doesn't look real to me. But I do like uh, this one color better than the last one. Uh, this is also an E-case. <coughs> New for 2018 Corvette C70 Z06 convertible. With the PR5s, the blacked out PR5s. Factory Fresh series. This was a D case. <coughs> Excuse me. Dodge Charger Daytona, the tuned Dodge Charger, but this one is in the Muscle Mania series. I thought this was kind of cool. This is an E case. Brand new for 2018 Custom Ford Maverick. 
This is actually based off a real car from what I understand. Hit the camera. Let's see if I can get this situated right. All right. Sorry. E case. A recolor on the Fiat 500. I like this because this is gloss color black and the last one was a satin red. I didn't like it. E-case. And the uh, Oni Warthog. Oni Warthog. Hot Wheel Screen Time. From uh, the video game Halo. That was a C case. Uh, I've never, I don't play video games, so I'm uh, not familiar with this vehicle at all. In pop culture, I found number two of five for the Scooby Doo series, Highway Hauler. Uh, Blister's cracked right here, so. If I don't find another one with a good blister, it's kind of opening up right here. And uh, I'll just take that out. So, somewhere I do have the Austin minivan. So, um, I'm still looking for the other three left. The Mystery Machine, the 34 Dodge Delivery, and the Volkswagen T1 panel. These out of the way for a moment. <clears throat> Found the green light blue collar series nineteen thirty nine Chevrolet panel truck. Series three. So in this series, they have two 39 Chevrolet panel trucks. They have one that's genuine Chevrolet parts, which is what I found. And the other one is a Krispy Kreme Donuts. And there you can see what else they have in this series. Um, I'll have to find it. But again, as I've said before, I like to collect Chevys. And this is something I don't have. So, old trucks are pretty cool. <coughs> Excuse me. What I'll do is I'll eventually take this out and put it inside a case. Uh, I don't have scissors right now to cut it open. So I'll do it another time. Here is the 1970 Chevrolet. Chevrolet Copo Chevelle SS from Greenlight. I have a couple of these. <coughs> Excuse me. I got something stuck, stuck in my throat. I don't know what that is in the windshield. Anyway, um, Copo is uh, it's either corporate office or central office production order. It's where someone can pretty much order a flat-out race car. Oh, I guess it's this symbol here, Meekum Sold. Um, someone can just order pretty much a race car from the factory floor if they knew what to check off. Of course, they would be paying for it, you know, be quite expensive uh, for the time. But uh, it could be done. So that's uh, basically what it is. 
So these are the items that I found this week. Um, I don't have scissors right now, so uh, I'll save these to open them up uh, in another video. So any comments, questions, things you'd like to see, uh, please get back to me. Uh, leave me a message. Uh, please like the video and subscribe. Thanks a lot.